I'm doing another soda taste test. This time I have Fanta Peach. It looks like another import from Japan. I see some kanji here as well as some kanji on the back, but this is Phantom Peach. A lot of times, you know, you might give a chick a six. That's really like ugly, but we trying to be like not mean. <laughs> I'm back rocking another Patrice scale. This one is gonna be with Fanta Peach. It looks like it is a Japanese import. Big shout out to my Nihonjins out there. Uh, watashi wa used to live in uh, Nippon uh, Niju Nimai, uh, which means I, in my very, very basic Japanese, I lived there about 20 years ago. Big shout out to my people over there in Tokyo, uh, my folks over there in Roppongi and uh, Shibuya used to rock over there in Gaspanic all the time, so that was my spot. And this one right here is a Japanese import. Looks like I'm gonna be rocking some Japanese imports for a while, because I have a few from over there at Pete's Pop in West Palm Beach. They had a lot of different sodas, so I dropped some change down with them and got a lot of those imports. Today, I'm gonna to be checking out Fanta Peach. As far as Fantas go, Fanta is always going to be kind of low or end, low budget kind of soda. I have, of course, drank Fanta's before. I've never had the peach, so I'm curious about this one. Uh, but I don't really expect much because it's a Fanta. First things first, this is a tiny, 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 tiny can. Reminds me like those little hugs. Remember little hugs back in the day? I'm assuming it's going to be eight ounces. I can't really see like any writing on here. Uh, but right now, I just want to get into it, see if uh, they can make me a see what you can do first like literally no fizz at all it didn't pss, none of that so I'm kind of worried Fanta definitely artificial peach artificial peach smell but still I can't really tell if it's carbonated I guess the only way to find out is to find out It's weird for the first, I don't know if you can see this can. I'm denting the can because I'm trying to suck the, the fluid in, the water in as I'm drinking. Uh, I don't think that's the right way to do it because my can is all dented up now. And if I try to uh, reset it, then I'm gonna splash soda everywhere. I'm trying to undent my can. It's still dented up, but it's not as bad. <laughs> I, guess, uh, I guess I'm drinking it wrong. So I'll try and drink it without denting this can this time. It's carbonated, but a little bit of carbonation to it. Artificial peach flavor all day long. It's, it's really, I mean, it's really peachy. I'll tell you that, hence peach. But I'm not really, not really a believer. Come on, Fanta. I mean, we can do better than this, can't we? What I'm finding is Japanese sodas don't tend to have as much of a punch as American sodas. Uh, so that's maybe why I'm not really feeling this. I don't know. Uh, but I mean, it's, it's, we, like I said, when I opened this up, it didn't even fizz like a normal soda would, whether it's a can or even a, a bottle. Um, I guess right now it's just to rate it, right? So I give it to them on the peach, giving them higher ratings than I would because they nailed the artificial peach flavor. As far as trying to nail it being peach, it definitely is not a hint of peach. It's like, full on peach. So let me go ahead and rate you at a, I was gonna give it an eight, but I'm gonna have to bump it up because of the peach, because it's all peach in here. Um, it's gonna be a 12. I'm gonna give this a 12. It's a bad tasting, all right, peach soda. So the reason why I brought it down to a 12 is because it doesn't have that punch. I was expecting it to have a soda punch and it really doesn't. It's, um, it's not really that carbonated. So I'm bringing it down to a 12. I would rate it higher if it had more of a soda punch to it. And plus, it's a tiny bottle. Like, if it did like this, I'd have to get like 20 of these to even cleanse my palate. I mean, I, I use, it's an aluminum can, so you can't really see inside of it, but I'm assuming it's gonna be about here. And you've seen how much I drank already. So like I said, it's probably eight ounces. We'll just pretend that soda companies actually fill it all the way to the brim. So that is literally to the brim. Oh shoot, it might be 12. Ah, nope. 
not quite 12 ounces. I'd say 10 ounces. It's between, looks like it's between the eight and the 12. If we do that Midwest public school mathematics system, then it sounds like that would be 10. The distance between eight and 12 is two or it's four. I'm sorry. See, there we go. Public school system. The dif distance between eight and 12 is four. Divide that in half is two. So I would say that's probably 10 ounces right there. Measuring cup don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> Regardless, even if it was 12 ounces, it would not change my score. You still get what you get. So I think 12 is a very fair number. That is my Patrice scale, Fanta Peach, 12 out of 30. And I'm gonna go ahead and roll up out. Did you assuredly go to club? All right looking, all right looking. <laughs>